Hi and welcome back to a Singles Functions video here. Uh, I hope you're having a great time in lockdown again. Uh, so Happy New Year to everyone as well. I hope this is a better one than last year, 2021. Today we're going to be having a look at snap automation. So what does that mean? That means you'll be able to snap the automization so it will not be in between values. So you go to snap go down to snap automation you have to activate it and then select what you want so i've done a quarter here just to show you what it does so if i've got a dot here and i want to move it it will only go a quarter okay so you can then set the uh, snap automation to what you want it can be a bar it can be an eighth so here if we do an eighth it will only move an eighth and not sixteenth as you can see so that is pretty useful when you're automating stuff precisely. So uh, there you have uh, Snap Automation. I hope you enjoyed this video. If it was useful for you, like, subscribe, and I'll be back soon. Ciao. Oh yeah, and whilst you're here, I would just like to talk about something that I just started up, uh, another YouTube channel about my own music that I've been releasing for the last 20 odd years. And what I'm doing is, uh, posting up videos of, um, well, just songs of uh, tracks that I released on various different labels from all over the world over the last 20 years. So there's probably going to be about 100 tracks up there at one point. Um, I think I've got like two on at the moment. There's a link in the description to the channel if you're interested in finding out. I do like jazzy house stuff under the name The Rhythm Slaves. Uh, so if, that's, uh, if that interests you, take a look. Anyway, see you soon. Ciao.